Hello guys, today we're going to watch the home shots. And we really don't have anything to do except for Yellowstone taking the top three spots. Which is which makes sense because the TV show is a very big TV show made by a pair of my home video and has been pretty successful. The next movie is the tax collector which has which has risen down to number four. The movie doesn't really have good reviews, so I was surprised it topped it for that long. Topped the list for that long. Number five is the King of Staten Island, making at number five spot. This is a pretty popular this is a movie that is a potential Oscar winner movie. The movie has done pretty okay at the international box office at least. Trolls World Tour. Trolls World Tour is a pretty successful movie. On Blu-ray and DVD especially and on VOD and internationally as well. Next, and of course it's continuing to do well even though I hate Trolls. But at least it's doing pretty well. The Silent Scene, it's a new movie, it's doing pretty okay. The Vanis is doing pretty okay, and Black Panther went up to sales because of the guy in who plays Black Panther dying, sadly. But yep, now Black Panther is num number 9 on this list. Made in Italy is at number 10. It's another newer movie. The Outpost dropped to number 11. As well as Sonic stays at number 12, so nothing new. Bill and Ted increases in both Bill and Ted and the sequel are up because of the new Bill and Ted. Maybe you might see Christopher Nolan movies go up and sit, go up next week. Harry Potter is still at 15, has insane from last week. The rental still ha has went down five spots. Game of Thrones seasons one through eight has been doing pretty has re released re released the chart. Tesla is re is a new movie as well. Deep Blue Sea doing pretty well for a sock movie. And 1913 we entered the charts for the first time for a while. So yep, that's basically about the movie charts, and that's basically it. Goodbye.